I don't believe this. You guys throw me at the wolves, and now you want me to go back out there? Forget it. It's not my problem. Can I finish? No. There's no way. Ripley, you wouldn't be going in with the troops. I can guarantee your safety. <laughs> See, these colonial marines are very tough hombres. They're packing state-of-the-art firepower. There's nothing they can't handle. Lieutenant, am I right? That's true. We've been trained to deal with situations like this. Fine, and you don't need me. I'm not a soldier. Yeah, but we don't know exactly what's going on out there. It may just be a down transmitter, okay? But if it's not, I would like you there as an advisor. And that's all. What's your interest in all this? Why are you going? The corporation co-financed that colony along with the colonial administration. We're getting into a lot of terraforming now and building better worlds. Yeah, and yeah, I saw the commercial. Look, I don't have time for this. I've got to get to work. All right. I heard you're working in the cargo docks. That's right. Running loaders and forklifts, that yeah. sort of thing? so? Nothing. I think it's great that you're keeping busy. And I, I know it's the only thing that you could get. There's nothing wrong with it. What would you say if I told you I could get you reinstated as a flight officer? The company has already agreed to pick up your contract. If I go. Yeah, if you go. Come on, that's a second chance, kiddo. And I think personally for you, it would be the best thing in the world to get out there and face this thing. Get back on the horse. Spare me, Burke. I've had my psych evaluation this month. Yeah, I know. I've read it. You wake up every night, your sheets are soaking with sweat. I said no, and I mean it. Now, please leave. I am not going back, and I am... I would not be any good to you if I did. Okay. Shh. Would you do me a favor? Just think about it. Thanks for the coffee.